This segment brought to you by Kansas Regenerative Medicine Center. Your stem cells, your health, your life. The bluff at Castle Rock rises over the Hackberry Creek Valley of Gove County Plains, visible for miles and miles. Castle Rock stands about a quarter mile away to the north, made of Niobrara chalk. It was an odd landmark for folks passing along on the Butterfield Overland Dispatch. The formation literally looked like a castle rising in the distance. Though nature carved the unique installation through erosion, folks were terribly disappointed when the taller spire of Castle Rock partially collapsed on July 22, 2001, after a thunderstorm. The great puzzle of Castle Rock is why it persisted when all the rock between it and the bluff was eroded away. The bluff itself is a series of eroded formations called hoodoos and are just as interesting as the castle and quite extensive. The flat grassy area is chalk flat prairie dominated by little blue stem, side oats, grama, and salt grass. Many wildflowers bloom from late spring to early fall. Lesser earless lizards, ornate box turtles, plains garter snakes, and western hognose snakes are found in the area. Western rattlesnakes may be present, so look where you step. Watch for great horned owls that nest in the hoodoo area. Look for shark's teeth and other fossils among the chalk rocks and gravel, since this area was once the bottom of a large ocean. This is private land, so be respectful. There are no restroom facilities, so plan accordingly. Also, the roads are not paved, so use common sense in case of wet weather. When the planets are aligned for your visit, plan to go and spend some time exploring. Hey folks, welcome. I'm here with Holly Martin of the High Plains Journal, and she has some exciting news to share. Yeah, we're having Cattle U here in Dodge City on July 31st and August 1st. It's going to be a great event, and I... I am so thankful that you would bring it here to Dodge City in Kansas. Yeah, it's, it's the heart of cattle country. We were going to have a great speaker lineup, just just as you know you're going to yeah. be a part of it. Well, I, I I looked at the speaker lineup and I was just blown away. It's going to be something there for everyone. Absolutely. We hope that people come and, and spend two days with us learning. And it's not just for feedlot operators. No, no. Cow-calf producers, um, stalkers, uh, there's a little something for everybody. Yeah, and you're going to have a trade show with it? Yeah, trade show. Great information to be able to learn in the educational sessions and then go outside and be able to find partners to work with. Come network with a bunch of cattle producers here in Dodge City. We're all going to be here, and it's going to be a great time. Thank you so much, Ollie. Thank you. <laughs> 